If Greg leaves tomorrow, what is his legacy? You got to think his legacy is pretty good, right? There are going to be those who are going to say he was awful and this was a wasted four years. But I think his legacy is going to be pretty good. I, I, I don't know if you would agree, but let's just look at it. He has beaten Mexico three different times since 2021 and is undefeated against them since 2021 starts. He has won the CONCACAF Nations League. He has won the Gold Cup. He has qualified for the World Cup. He has drawn an England team that's top five in the world, and he has made it out of the group stage at a World Cup. He's also recruited some very impressive dual nationals that were among our best players at this World Cup, such as Serginho Dest and Yunus Musa, and possibly Falaire and Balogun is going to commit here in the next few weeks. So you can't look at where we were at in 2018 and the youth revolution that we've had since then being led by Greg Berhalter and say that his tenure was a failure.